Come on, bitches. There he is. Done. If the heat was rising, that meant I was getting closer to the source. I had to keep moving. Noise. If there was one thing I learned since being in Sao Paulo, it was that me and the local elevators were not a good mix. supposed to do in here? Oh. No. Okay, where the hell am I supposed to go? No. Jesus. Whatever depressing fate lay on the other side of those doors, there was no point in putting it off any longer.
Hey, look! Shit. Die, bitch. I'd killed more cops than cholesterol, and still no sign of Becker. It wasn't the first time it dawned on me I should probably have gone over the plan in more detail. But it was... I still didn't know how I'd gone from drinking myself numb in New Jersey to looting corpses in Brazil. But this was where I was, 5,000 miles from a home I couldn't go back to on another suicide mission to clean up a mess that wasn't even mine. <laughs> I'd spent my career dozing off in the briefing room. The CS were all but out of business in Sao Paulo, and suddenly Becker and Victor looked like local heroes in the war on crime. They'd really gotten their money's worth outsourcing their problems onto me. My old pal Serrano. We'd both been unwitting clowns in this sorry circus. Part of me hoped he'd made it out of that hotel alive. I didn't recognize the guy. Maybe this was the new slum king De Silva had talked about. A throne never stays empty for long. Fame at last. It was no great surprise I'd made Ufe's most wanted list. I hadn't done much to improve the reputation of Americans abroad over the past few weeks. And there they were, my illustrious employers. Three dead and still, every chance I'd go four for four. None of this was going to look good on the resume. And I was in good company. Howl Passos, sent up north to find a washed-up gringo who would act tough and play dumb. Boy, did he ever deliver. Nice. Okay. Are there any pills around here? Guess not. Okay. There's the pills. Looking around for shit. I don't know what I'm looking for, but I'm just gonna roam around. guys who jumped the yacht in Panama. And what was this? Had the Brazilian cops tipped them off about the money? Hmm. Bitches. Judging by the music, oh shit! Damn! That's just pure reaction time. Some weapon. Ah. 
bitch. Take some buckshot to the gut. Starting to feel as if I'd never leave that place. Like one of those nightmares where you keep running and running only to discover you're chasing yourself. Oh shit, that's. Ugh. Tear gas. This wasn't good. I needed to find a way out of that stairwell and fast. The bastards had me locked in. This was a waste of time. The doors were all locked. There had to be something else I wasn't seeing. If I didn't do something soon, I was gonna be crying myself to a very long sleep. and throat burned, but at least I could breathe. I was trying to work out what direction I was headed in when I discovered some more Brazilian architecture not designed for the American physique. Oh, right in the friggin' right in the cranium. Server room. Pills. Right there. Nope. Maybe not. There it was. The tape from the Bronco security system. Oh, this should be interesting. Jesus, oh. it was that guy. I had seen him in the favela. Bachmeyer, Becker's right-hand man. His time would come. Him and Becker. O seu dinheiro representa o seu futuro. Mantenha o seguro com o Banco Boitatá para a sua really? casa, Shut o up. seu carro. I'd seen enough. It was time to bring this nightmare to an end. <laughs> 